All right, brother, we live. How's it going, man? We're doing pretty good. What's your name? Joshua. Joshua? Nice yeah. to meet you, man. Are you from here? No, I'm from Topeka, Kansas. Yeah? What you doing out here? Who brought you out here, Albuquerque? I came out here with a girl, and uh, she brought me out here, said we were going to get clean, and that uh, we were, we were going to start a whole new thing. I was going to get my job back and shit. And she she brought me out here just randomly, like it, it, she, it was in the it was in the matter of three days, and and all of a sudden she she just got kind of overwhelmed, and um, she ditched me in Albuquerque. We moved to Grants Milan too. Yeah, that's that's the thing. We moved to Grants Milan, and then she brought me here to Albuquerque. How long have you been in Albuquerque? Two and a half years. Two and a half years. I'm twenty two. You're twenty two. Yeah. I was gonna ask you. So, uh, what made you decide to come to Albuquerque uh, to get clean? And where are you trying to get clean off of? Uh, the meth. Meth? What brought you out here to try to get clean out here versus wherever you're from? Um, just it's just, it, the place where I'm from is just riddled. It's just riddled with, with this and that. Yeah. Tit for tat. I was going to say, this, this probably can't be any better than over there, is it? It's a little or bit is it better. A little better? So yeah, what happened with you guys getting clean? Did you uh, did, did did you both uh, get it started, or did you? Where were you at oh, in the phase of that? Oh yeah, did you we, started getting we clean. Got started. Did you check into somewhere or something, or you just? No, we just we just moved here, thing? and then and then and then she went out looking for it. Yeah. What uh? What do you think triggered her? Um. Just boredom. Yeah. Definitely not a lot to do here, man. No. So I could see how that works. But uh, so she went out and scored, and then uh, did you did you hit it up with her at the same time, or did yeah, you, she came did you back. She came back home, and fucking all of a sudden we're both dirty on meth again. Yeah. How long were you guys clean for? Three months. Three months. That's pretty good, man. So were you working at the time? No, that's the thing. I couldn't find a job. Was she working? No. So yeah, you guys are definitely fighting the boredom. Yeah. So how long ago was that? Did she uh? Do you, or how long were you guys using before she ended up jumping shit? About roughly? a month and a half. So when she left, do you know where she went, or she just jumped shit? Yeah, I knew like half the time. The other half the time, I had no freaking clue. Yeah. Okay with her, you guys kind of kind of beefing, or did she just kind of up and leave and left yeah. you hanging? Yeah, she just kind of left, and, and I didn't know where she was going. Yeah. Did you guys have a place to stay at the time when you guys yeah. first came here? Yeah. Yeah. So she left and pretty much left you hanging. So did you, you hit the streets, or do you Sometimes. got a place to stay now? Sometimes I'd go find something to do. What do you do to survive, man? I pulled up and I seen you had a sign. Is that your main anything that you're doing? Yeah. Just trying to keep it non-violent. Yeah. Uh, we got homies pulling up on the side. We keep an eye over here. Yeah, they're kind of curious. Check that out. So, uh, you still using present day? Yeah. Yeah, just meth. Meth and M30s. I used to do heroin heavy. I was I was heavy on the on heroin. What's up, man? Huh? This is, this is a homie, or he's got a YouTube channel. Stop shooting a video right now. You still using, man? You still, no. Are you doing a uh, meth? Or what do you meth what, what are you messing with right now? Meth and M30s. Yeah. That's it, really. How long you been messing with blue? Um, probably like a year now. Yeah. What? What? Uh, were you always using that at the same time with the meth, or did you uh start doing no, that recently? Rarely at the same time with meth, but um, always, always just to just to like just really just fall asleep. How do you feel like they hit compared to the meth? Is it uh more addictive? Do you feel like? Yeah. Yeah. So it got a hold of you? Yeah, kind of. 
Like I feel stupid for it sometimes. How did you, what made you decide to try it? Did you uh, just experimenting or did you, uh, someone introduce you to it? Um, Do you remember the first time that you used? I think I, I think I just gave up on saying no. Yeah, just figured you see what it was about. Yeah. Did it feel like uh, it got a hold of you pretty quick after the first or second try, roughly, or did it take a little while? Oh no, I, I was hooked the first time. You feel it? How many uh, you do a day? You think roughly? Six or seven. Yeah. So I've been hearing it. I ain't tried it, man. Is it? Is it? Is it got the popcorn taste in there? Everyone's saying it's popcorn. I say it's it's buttered caramel. Buttered caramel. Yeah. Yeah. Do you plan on trying to uh, get get try to get clean again off of everything that you're using, or are you not at that point in your your life right now? You're just rolling with it. Maybe later in the future. It's not that point in my life. Not ready right now. Just. Rolling with it. Mm -hmm. I'm planning on getting clean in the future. Definitely by the time I'm 35. Yeah. What kind of work would you like to do? Construction. You, construction? Is that what you were doing before? Would you like it? Yeah. Or what, what type are you doing? Electrical or building? Um, I was doing welding and uh, maintenance. Yeah. It's cool, man. I always wanted to learn how to weld. So, what's it like out here on the on the streets? Um, do you consider it dangerous? Um, it's just depend on who you yeah, hang around. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes it's dangerous. What's the craziest thing that you've seen out here? A dude get shot in the head uh, right in front of Circle K. Is it uh, drug related or just? It was just, just random. It's random. Crazy man. Right on, brother. Well, I appreciate your time, man. Is there anyone you want to give uh, any shout outs to, or if they see this video, or any social media you want to drop? To my family. I love my family my mom, my uncle, my cousins, my grandma and grandpa, mm -hmm. my whole family. Yeah. So let them know you're doing all right. Yeah. Right on, man. Appreciate your time, brother. And you okay with me using this on my YouTube channel? Yeah, most definitely. Right on, man. Thank you.